are understandably skeptical about how it could be that these vaccines have been developed and tested in, in clinical trials so quickly. So there is some, some uh, element of, of distrust and I think that is absolutely fair. The reason that it went so quickly is that massive amounts of funding, particularly public funding, were invested that allowed these trials and the developments to go on in parallel. So normally you would do phase one trials, you would look at the results, then you take a decision, do we take it to a phase two trial? Remember, these trials are extremely expensive to run. And I find it absolutely amazing that within less than a year, we had several vaccines that had been proven in all the clinical trials as being highly effective and very safe. One reason that everybody should hopefully become immunized against uh, COVID-19 is that as long as you allow this virus to circulate, it does what viruses do and they do that very well, unfortunately, they change. And now it's a problem, of course, how to get them into people. So firstly, how to make enough of it, and then secondly, how to give it to the people who need it, uh, which is ultimately everybody on Earth. But we, of course, want to start with certain risk groups that we now have the highest risk of getting COVID. Mm -hmm.